Why, hello again. Take two. <laughs> Take two. <laughs> Helps to plug the microphone in. <sighs> oh, well. Uh, so we're going to do a um, haul from an online auction. I just said a whole bunch of other stuff. I'm not going to say it again. Uh, but I did tell it, say Daisy had her growth removed today. We switched veterinarians. Very, very happy we did. Was not cancerous at all in any way, shape, or form, but um, just said probably be better to go ahead and remove it because she probably starts to mess with it and yeah. it could get infected and stuff. And um, she's home uh, right now. She's behaving, so she doesn't have to wear the cone of shame. Uh, but we'll see as the evening goes on. She's also still a little loopy, so that may she may start bothering it uh, as she starts getting off the medications. Yeah. But um, anyway, so we spent a grand total of thirty-three dollars and fifty-nine cents. Big haul. Yeah, big haul. Oh. And okay, you want to start oh, showing them? I even looked at. No, he it. tried to start digging it. I made him quit. Well, I just was curious. And then he got his feelings hurt. Now he didn't get them. That's right. I'm good. I think that just, that's, not, that's not right. Oh, there it goes. There it goes this way. I'm still trying to figure out which way you went. Yeah. Yeah, we go. got a dream catcher. Whopping. Monstrous dream catcher. Dream catcher. And I don't know what this is. Ponytails. It's a well, dream I mean, catcher with ponytails. I don't know what it's made out of. Oh, this? Yeah. This cotton feels like. Feels like raw cotton. I don't know. I mean, I know. I don't know. I have no this idea. Is unwired. This has just been right off the plant. You see, there's still seeds in there. I mean, it's, it's cotton. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, Raw cotton. This is... Cardboard? Well, turn around and see the other side. This is, this is a cardboard ring, but this is this is hide of oh, some sort. I think supposed to hang in the front. Oh, those hang yeah, in the front? Yeah, but it goes on the wall, so you... Yeah. Oh, there's the thing in my bobbery you hang it from right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But uh, this feels like... Actual hide. Oh, there's feathers. I didn't even notice. Did you notice the feathers? Yeah. Well, not because they're all backwards well, for some reason. Well, all, everything's all flipped around. Oh, you notice the little, little medallion? The conchos? Uh, yeah, that's what they're called, yeah. <laughs> we're so good at this, you can tell. It, yeah. It's wonderful when we're writing descriptions up. Uh, I write the descriptions Yeah, up. don't want me writing them. <laughs> that's, uh, that's okay. But anyway, so... Um, oh, did what you, you pay for this and the other? Uh, this, this and some other Native American stuff I got for eleven dollars. Yeah. Think you can hang it on the hook back there. Yeah, that's what it is. Um, I have no idea. I don't know if it's truly Native American, if it's made in Japan, China, Native American. I don't know. Um, this is a snowman dream catcher. Another dream catcher. This is rawhide. Yeah, rawhide wrapped around. It feels like a metal ring. Yeah, with feathers and pony beads. Uh, oh, got a feather. It's shedding. So, uh, yeah, another. Contrast in there so you can see it. Because it blends in with the wall back here. Yeah. Yeah, so, got two drone catchers. Uh, yeah, like I can read that. Magnifying glasses. Matted and framed to. Oh, good gracious, look how tiny that is. Uh, it says something blanket. By maybe it's either K K E Y or oh medicine woman hind no. hind Walker hind Walker medicine woman this one is okay this says marriage blanket 1991 K and it's, uh, Murphy and it's K Murphy. Hand yeah. signed by her too. Yeah, hand signed. It's printed, but then it's hand signed. This is where they say it's signed twice. 
This one is. Yeah, when we go to these auctions. It's signed twice. It's signed three times. They're really nice. I mean, they're professionally uh, framed. This one. Yeah. Uh, really nice. Marriage blanket and medicine woman. Yeah. So, have no idea what those will... I don't know. What do you want me to do with this stuff? Can we stack it right there? Yeah, that's fine. That's covered my price sheet up. Oh. This is all the same lot. Uh, uh, still working on the eleven dollars. This is take the light off there. No. Uh, Patrick Spencer? This? No, no, that's not Patrick. It's Clinton, Clinton Spencer, Spencer, 1999, 1999, and it and is it's also signed twice. Signed twice. Uh, this is cute. This is a. Uh, yeah. Pen and ink print. Uh, yeah, I think it's a print. Well, yeah, it's a print. Yeah, it's definitely a print. But yeah, that's cute. The bears with the uh, uh, sap honey, bucket. Sap buckets. And oh, look on the back. Oh, Clint Spencer, Shenandoah Valley artist, Staunton, Virginia, wildlife historical pen and ink art. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but that's a cute one. Hmm, that kind of a musty smell to it. Well, it came out of. An estate sale. Everything. Yep. All right. This is nothing is so strong as gentleness. Nothing is so gentle as real strength. Uh, I'm trying to see if there's a. Signature. Ooh, this is a, a cut uh, cut mat. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I see that now. Yeah, it costs more to do that. Yeah. yeah. The back. Uh, nothing on the back. I'd have to open it up. You want me to? Well, not right now. Oh, okay. Uh, it's a, two wolves. And I need to angle that. There we go. Just glare off of it. I don't know. I, I don't know. We, we were, I was discussing with somebody the other day how people keep changing what they want to be called, and I can't keep up with it. And I don't mean offense to anybody if I call you something that you don't want to be called. It's, I called somebody Asian the other day, and they're like, it's Oriental, it's Oriental. I mean, I didn't mean anything by it. I can't keep up with this stuff. And then. Everybody was black, and then the Caribbean started complaining. No, everybody was African American. Then the Caribbean started complaining because they'd never been to Africa. So then we're back to black, and then the African Americans are complaining because mm -hmm. they wanted to be African. I don't know. Like I say, I don't mean offense to anybody. Was that all of it? That was all that. One okay, that all of that was eleven dollars total. So mm -hmm. I should get my hopefully my eleven dollars yeah, back. I'm pretty sure. That anyway, I went box, off on one of my tangents. Box of electronics. Okay, yeah, this is what Max wanted to do again, and I wouldn't let him. Music and electronics. Paid $11. You guys see a theme here? These are. This is, uh, this we may keep for ourselves just to use when we go and do, I don't know, maybe we'll. What, broadcast from the. Well, sometimes, you know, we get invited to the, some shows and. This has got the boom mic in it. And it goes boom. Oh, what we already had? We have no, headsets. No, we have the. Well, we don't really need it because we got our mic. We got our little snowflake. So we don't really need it, I guess. Yeah. It's all knotted up and. Well, it should end here somewhere. There we go. There's that one. And then we have another set of headphones and cords and everything it's all tangled up these oh. are lab tech reasonable brand never heard of it lab tech their audio equipment maybe there's another one these are sony oh my this. god the it's, little fuzzy parts are yeah the fuzzy part came off there's there's a big padded thing that goes probably they're probably in the box here somewhere I don't know but and this is for the old iPhones you've got the big wide clip and this is the thing you plug into your cigarette lighter you turn them on turn them off it just has an on off button and it has the FM thingy you can broadcast to your radio on your car yeah or somebody else's radio in somebody else's car if they happen to be tuned to your panel. Three and a half inch discs. Still sealed. Sealed in the box. Ooh, 52 speed CD ROM drive. For those people who still use CDs. Let's 
like this. Don't even know what it is. Most display fun. display protector, keyboard protector, and anti glare protector. Or droid. Razor or droid. M. Got a Sony Discman. These are a lot better shape than the other ones. Short cord though. We have I don't iPhones. see a brand name. Oh, we have on I everything. So. I don't see a brand name on them anywhere. Stereo. There's another set of headphones with a little microphone built into it, I think. I'm not sure. Or that's just a volume control. I don't know what that is. It's a volume control. Now, this box of discs has been opened and there's some missing out of it. Health by the numbers. I have no idea. It clips on it. a little belt clip. Oh, well, it had a belt clip. Oh, well. Plastic when it gets old. There's a phone charger for Samsung phone charger. Uh... USB cable for looks like a phone, probably a uh, uh, Motorola USB cable. Ooh. Oh no, this is a full size, isn't it? Well, the next sound stereo cassette player with the this one has a belt clip on my head. I'm not going to pull on it like I did that one. That was a mistake. Um, can't tell. Oh, right there. There. No, nope, no tape in it. Cassette player. Takes full size cassettes. And like I said, got the belt clip. And one more. This is what caught our attention. Okay. Crud off one of the disintegrated ear pads off that one thing there. And we got a Bell and Howe nine band world receiver. He's glaring. Tilt it. There we go. I got, got the nice little antenna on there. Um, oh, not good. A little bit of. Corrosion on the batteries. Well, I need to clean that up. Yeah. Vinegar. It doesn't look real bad, but uh, that's why you go to the previews, but yeah, so you don't pick up stuff like this. But I had it one time over here. I don't know. I don't see it here, but yeah, I can work on this. Yeah. I might be able to fix vinegar. it. You can vinegar. Yeah, a little Q-tip and vinegar. Yeah, we've been wanting a multi-band radio for a uh, while, so that's. Kind of why we got that one. So, um, you want me to knock all the trash out of this box and then we can just set this back in that box? Yeah, you can do that yeah. if you want. I'll be right back in each other. Well, you want me to slide this over? And then I saw a selection of books that caught my eye. I know Debbie, you have five, you just got 500 books. Why the heck we done more books? Well, They are autographed, uh, and they are by Rita Mae Brown, and she writes mystery books about cats. Well, I don't know about cats. I guess the cats are involved in the books. Uh, da -da -da -da. And they're first editions. And when I looked up uh, her sales, they were good. Uh, and especially uh, autographed first editions. So I paid 
seven dollars. in the box is all the same author uh, no I think there's some other but um, another Rita this one she signed on a library plate and I think it's, oh. yeah all of these are to somebody named Nancy yeah so Nancy. it must have been the lady's estate hit the jackpot bingo oh <laughs> bingo. yeah and uh, so hopefully I will do okay with these. Let me see. Um, I'm sorry. I'm trying to see the thing where it says first edition. Um, this one's not signed. So are they not all signed? No. Okay. No, they're not all signed. This one, of course, is missing the dust jacket too, which really lowers the value. Can we pull them all up or? Well you can see make a stack. You don't have to pull them out. Because like, um, they're going to block the. Oh we're going to. Those on here have been chewed on. Oh. Not signed. No it's it's they sign on the title page honey. That's the appropriate. Oh. No. Yeah. That's where you sign though. Just in case you get a brighter book. You sign it on the title page. Well, and so I used whoever to whoever signed that one. I used to work. Well, she put the library plate in there. That's where she wanted it signed. The person who bought it. That was her personal library plate. Oh, that one? Yeah. Yeah, she should have signed it here. Yeah. I used to work in bookstores and we had authors come through. And, um, they would just sign, 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 sign. And then they always left. 20, depending on the author, how popular, 20, 50, 100 signed copies that we still sold after they had been for the people who couldn't come to the, uh, I don't know, the, they usually read something from the book and then they, you know, sit and sign or whatever. I actually have a friend who wrote a book that's coming out in July uh, here and uh, I read the proof copy. I actually was, you know, that's okay. Well, I don't know. It's not, it's not happening that often, but I was, you know, you're afraid it's not going to be a good book and you're going to have to say, oh, it actually was a really good book. It, uh, it made me want to know more, but it was like a kind of biography. Somebody lived and somebody died, so there is no more. But yeah, it made me very interested in the uh, people in the book. So I will we'll go to the book. I don't know what it's called. Preview. Book signing. Yeah. Book signing. Yeah. We, uh, only a few of them. Only those well, I don't know. She said it was only like six or seven that were yeah. signed. So. But uh, you've got a lot of first editions and you've got hardbacks. Uh, so yeah. that'll add value to these. Two. Almost all the hardbacks have covers. The best covers have. Yeah. And then we have one trade size. Yeah, same, same author. Yeah, I thought there was, I mean, not a lot of other authors in there, but I thought there was some other authors. And then there is Rita, Rita. Maybe she didn't know her, and she met her later on after she had read so many of her books or something. So maybe the earlier books, she didn't buy the hardbacks and didn't know her. That could be. The third box looks like it's all written. This first box is all ready made brown. Mm -hmm. uh, that definitely should pay for the entire lot of no, everything I bought. I'm willing to bet that one's signed. Oh, it says Nancy. Yep. Yep. Signed. They put a sticker on that. They, they, put, they put a post a note on the outside of the ones that are signed. But this is a. Uh, 
to the Adams. Sing a pretty song, the offbeat life of Edie Adams, including the Ernie Kovac years. Oh, this is a bar. Yeah. I didn't know she wrote anything besides. Uh, uh, another thing about this uh, online auction we went to, and when we go to pick it up, this had to be the most organized online auction when, and pickup setup that I've ever seen at any one of these we ever went to. In fact, every box that was set out, you know, that we had won, they had a little sign on each box, and all the boxes were together. So I don't know why they, I guess they found them, put the sign on them, and then they gathered them. Yeah, well, we used to grumpy pants, so he's... Yeah, well, this was a very pleasant surprise. Yeah, this was a place that's called Max Sold. They only do online auctions, and you can um, go online and look them up. Uh, huh, the drawing books usually do good. Books, yeah. This is the drawing figure. It, the the head, head and figure. figure. Yeah, those do halfway decent sometimes. That's and, uh, like a giveaway that's, yeah. when you type CPR. Yeah. All that stuff. Um, yeah. So uh, I do a lot, especially since I haven't been able to get ooh, out and about. The handbook of this, forensic pathology. Yeah, no, I really have this thing about forensics. I, I, I suck at science and math, and I would have been horrible, but I love the, the yeah. You've already read the Hoyle's Rules of Games. It's the abridged edition, I think, because it's awful short. Look, so you need to go outside. Oh, yeah, forensics. I love forensics. I, I like to watch all those horrible geeky shows. Medicine cards. Hmm, those are interesting. Are they... The discovery of Blankable. power through the ways of the animals. It's ah. sort of like a so this tarot is deck. Like, sort of like well, a tarot but this is like See, Native American. Eagle. Owl. Grouse. There's a frog. Jaguar. The butterfly. Huh. Elk. Never seen this before. Wild boar. Turtle. The mouse. My favorite. Oh, oh here's a little thing there. Medicine cards. Jamie Sams and David Carson. There's two things here. Two blank ones. Three. Three blank ones. Illustrated by Angela Wernicke. One. Huh. And they're numbered. They're all individually numbered. I have to go through. Oh, there's another blank one. Oh, never seen anything like them. Yeah, I've they, seen a lot of a bunch of blank ones. You know, being in New Orleans, we've seen all kinds of all kinds of weird, different types of decks. cards and stuff. Yeah, never seen one like this. Huh. Well, let's hope it. It might be. You know. It's like between all of this, let's hope we uh, make our money back. Oh, this is an offer I recognize. Yeah. yeah. James Patterson, Murder House. In fact, I actually think we had this book. I think he's one of the ones we're getting a set of. I, don't uh, know if we I think he's still on the show. Uh, he might be over here. He. Like there's somebody sitting on our table. Yeah, well, you can books. see over here. Yeah, if I turn it, you'd see books. We have the cone of death that we keep threatening Daisy with. The cone of shame. I'm sorry. Cone of shame. Yeah, let's show it to her. Oh, let's go. Yeah, it's probably definitely chewed on that one. Yeah, chewed corner on that one. You can see that. Yeah, if you're going to pack your books in boxes and put them in a garage or storage or whatever, throw some uh, cedar in there. Like you can get those little balls like in the laundry section in Walmart or whatever. Or you can go to, if you don't mind it, you can go to like, Pet Smart, or I don't know, Walmart may have them too, like the cedar shavings, like for hamsters and stuff, and just sprinkle them in there to keep the rats and stuff out because they love paper and they will chew, chew, chew. Everybody knows the yellow for dummies books, but I've not seen this one. The Complete Idiot's Guide to whatever. 
And this one happens to be World Religions. I might actually. But. In, well, kind of getting a high pile here, aren't we? <laughs> We're going through the books. There. Uh, I, had a, uh, I had a general physical, my normal general physical today. and I had mine last week. Yeah, well, mine was better than yours. And believe it or not, yeah, everything was fabulous. Blood pressure, uh, cholesterol, and all that kind of stuff was really good. And he, he really had a lot of nice things to say because um, before I had my gastric bypass, I was... Well, he told me, he said, five years, you're, you're, you're going to be dead. So I had it six years ago. So, uh, he, yeah, he told me, he said, I'm really, really pleased with how you look and how you're doing and all that. And he just told me to, uh, my weight has been creeping up a little because of the bad leg and not being able to get out and around and move around that much. But um, gonna, we were going to go today and on the way home from the doctor's, a uh, bad storm was trying to come through and we wanted to go pick up Daisy because she's terrified of storms and get her. Uh, we were going to go to this gym that's close to here and um, see about um, their water aerobics classes and stuff. And um, But then we decided let's try to hurry and get Daisy and get home before the storm hits. So um, we didn't make it. But uh, we tried. So I'll have to go, maybe, I'll go maybe tomorrow on the way to acupuncture and I'll see, uh, um, what their schedule and prices and all that were. Meditation for beginners. Um. Pin book. Yeah. That's late. Um, what else has been going on? Okay. You mean I'm not lazy, stupid, or crazy? Hmm. Self-help book. Atten AT ADD. Oh, attention deficit disorder. Okay. I don't have ADD. No. Not many things I have OCD. Have. Yeah, OCD. So do I. I mean, I comment on things as we're driving down the road. You know, the, the, the stakes on that steak bed truck are, they don't all line up the same way. You know, he should do something about that. Yeah, still you know? on TV drives us crazy. <laughs> oh, yeah, you'll see it on TV. You know. Yeah, and we're those people that notice from one scene to the next that stuff Something's has changed. Something's changed. Hey, baby girl. You know, when they went from this scene one into scene hey, two, then to girl. scene three, in scene two... The wallpaper that they put up in scene one wasn't on the walls, and then all of a sudden it was back on the walls again in scene <laughs> Oh, I know what I was going to remind y'all of. The contest. Oh, yeah. Oh, I forgot all about that. Yeah. Um, oh, how much we spent to have the... Hey, here's a book for the medicine cards. Get that with the cards. Oh. There's a book that goes with it. Uh, we have the contest going. Of, of the last video showed... Uh, I've been taking down a branch. branch out of a tree in our yard, and the contest was how much did it cost us to have that done, and uh, the one closest uh, will win a uh, present, prize, prize, prize. It's a dictionary. <laughs> What's well, the best pocket dictionary? Best pocket dictionary. Only the important words are in there. Huh. You can fire them. Finally. Mm -hmm. You can become what you, you can treat yourself. It's a little psychology. I get therapy. The world would not be a nice place if I didn't. Bird feeder book. He's slowly stifling more right now. And he's still pulling books out of the box that I pay seven dollars for. Card games for one or two. What if you have three? You have to play something else. Yeah. Fundamentals of nursing. Ooh. Another career in the making right there. I don't know where I'm going to put it. You want to something? I, where? I don't have any place to put it. The whole table's full from here down. We've got oh, okay. books. We've got over here. here. The Illustrated Do-It-Yourself Manual. 
Do what? Oh, okay. Just home repair. Consumer. Handyman. Yeah, handyman manual. Oh, the kids. Another career in the book. Yeah, well, the kids hired a financial planner for us because they were concerned uh, about our us and after our retirement, you know, living, not having to eat dog food and being homeless and stuff. But I like dog food. Well, uh, so we talked to the guy yesterday. Yep, yesterday. Yeah. Talked to the guy yesterday, and we can li keep living exactly like we're living comfortably, you know, roof, house, uh, everything we're doing now is very comfortable. If we start putting three thousand dollars a month away in savings plan, there's that tree out back I was telling you about. That one of these days, I'm pretty sure it's going to start sprouting money. They're, I know they're it. Paying I know this, it. They're paying this person for us to yeah. advise us. Yeah. And I'm thinking, if we put three thousand dollars in a savings account now, we don't have to worry about well, after we retire because we're, we're going to be homeless before then. <laughs> yeah. You know, we're, we're, I, I'm 61, he's 62, a little bit late, yeah. but they're terrified. They're absolutely terrified. That, we'll show up with our suitcases yeah, one day. <laughs> that they're going to wind up with us. They really are. Philip has already shown me. He says, Mama, I'll put you in the best nursing home I can find, but you ain't coming here. And that's fine. I'm fine with that. Maybe I don't want to go there. And... You know. might just buy a little trailer, camper, and go camping someplace. And not no. tell them where we're at. No. You like that? No. No. I ain't going to. You want to? No. But when the big, big end of the world comes, we'll be safe. A little mountain retreat. But that is a job opportunity for some of y'all. If we have to have three thousand a month in savings, we could get somebody to do it for less when we get older. Take care of us. Yeah. 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 Three thousand a month. That, that's decent wages. More than I make. Yeah. I know. It's what's so stupid about it. Yeah. Well, yeah, three thousand. I don't make that much. <laughs> You know, you just sit there and you're thinking, I, I don't understand a whole lot of stuff. And kids today, they're in their, my son's 30, what did we figure out? 39. 39. 39. So I, that's, he's still my kid, but he's not really a kid, but yeah. Your child. Yeah, they just, it's strange. Let's put $3,000 a month in the bank, and when you quit working at 70, you won't have any worries. Yeah. But, uh, and they're paying the guy. That's what kills me is they're paying the guy. I want to be a financial planner. I could tell people stuff like that. Yeah. Ooh. I can definitely pass that on. Yeah. I could just say that to anybody. Well, I guess if you're living nicer than us, you know, we'd have to put $4,000 a month in place. we just come and check your house over, look at it, and go, mm, okay, you can put away 2500 Anyway. It's just bizarre. I'd love to see. Uh, we saw uh, two families out today. Well, like Grandma and Grandpa out with the three, actually. Out with the kids, you know, like having lunch and doing things or whatever. And, and I love to see that. I love to see um, uh, Grandma and Grandpa spending time with the kids and taking them to places that Mommy and Daddy won't take them to and having fun and letting them eat stuff they shouldn't be eating. And yeah, that was... We question if we'll ever get the opportunity, but hopefully we will. Um, yeah. They have to have car seats, of course, now, and there's two of them, and we actually don't have a vehicle that we could get two car seats in, so. That's true. Yeah. Our little car. They won't fit. <laughs> ain't going to get no car seats. And seat. our van doesn't have uh, anything but passenger and driver seats. Yeah. So, um you know, maybe we're hoping when they like graduate from high school or something, that we could drive them to the graduation. I don't know. I don't know. Do you need to cut? How old do you have? No, they they probably would drive us because. Well, yeah. Well, by that time, we'll be. Yeah, we'll uh, be almost eighty. We'll be almost eighty. We'll yeah. be looking at eighty, so they're probably driving us. 
Yeah. Yeah, I hadn't thought about that. Well, maybe when they like, start driving at 16, maybe they'll take us places. Ooh. Take us to the grocery store every week. Okay. I want to do what my mom did. I'm going to take her to the Dollar Tree and have her ask me 15 times how much stuff is. That was always fun. How much is it? Dollar. How much is it? Dollar. How much is it? Dollar. Is it a dollar? This is before she got dementia. She just couldn't believe everything in the store was a dollar. And she thought, you know, she, I just like, this have some really nice things. I'm not saying that. They don't. They do. I'll buy stuff there all the time. Yeah, that, that was just, you yeah. know. We've been yakking. Chatting away. Yeah. There wasn't much of a haul. It was a little haul. A little haul. Oh, grinding again. Wow. Um. But we're going to, we may, it depends on what's going on. Um, I haven't looked at uh, garage sales, real estate sales for the weekend. Um, we may. We'll have an auction too this weekend. Did oh, you look at that yet? Yeah. I, I haven't looked at it yet. So. I wasn't that super impressed. Saturday mm -hmm. night, there's an auction. Uh, there's actually one tonight, but once again, it's like all, all, all new, new stuff. stuff. Yeah. Um, but uh, I'm sure we'll be back. This will. This is Thursday. What is it? Yeah, it's it Thursday. Friday all day for me. I'm so long. So this will go up tomorrow. It's going to be Friday. Well, we'll have to do on Sunday. Well, this will go up won. tonight. This will go up tonight. Oh. Anyway, we have to do on Sunday, even if it's only to say who won the contest. Yep. So we'll uh, do something. I'm having good sales. I might do a sales video. Yeah. Can we do that? I've got to figure out. Anyway, we can figure that out. We. Uh, me. Yeah. We each have <laughs> our jobs and videos on mine. But he did find a way to wear the... No, it's not a GoPro. Go, it's not a GoPro. It's the GoPro clone. Yeah. It's the gen generic GoPro thing. Yeah. He finally found a way he likes it and he will wear it on a baseball cap. And the 19th of May, the huh. Civic Center so here has a big auction. Is have, no. No, not an auction. A big They're having an indoor yard, yard sale. sale on the 19th of May. And we've been one time before, and it's it's big. It's huge. But yeah. we went late last time. Uh, I think, he, he doesn't believe me, and I'm not sure, but starts at 7. And uh, yeah, she'll be up. Yeah, right. I'm going to try. I'm going to try to get up. He'll have to. I'm probably still not going to be walking. Uh, that long by then, so he'll probably have to take me in the wheelchair. Um, but I'm going to try to get up and um, get there before all the goodies get gone, and, and I'm going to be selective. We're going to video the whole thing, right? Yeah. Yep. And we can cut and edit and whatever. Yep. But uh, I'm going to I'm gonna be selective. I've got a ton of stuff, all these books I got. I've got uh, other things that we're finding as we're digging, and um, of course, I'm always going to be looking for my vintage story that I love. Um, and, uh, no clothes, yeah. no clothes. I know that's good money. I know it's fast turnover, but I, I, I just, I don't have to do it. And I'm not, I'm going to do the ones I've got. Um, but no, no more. I hate them. I hate doing them. They're a pain in the rear. I can do six or eight other things for the time I can do one Two, one, one or two. two of those, yeah. So, no, no more clothes. Um, but, anyway, so that's, looking forward to that coming up, the 19th of May. Um, but anyway, just to let you know, we paid $33 and we got all that stuff. Well, all we this stuff, yep. So, like I say, oh, oh, sorry, the comment. Comer Shane Com is trying uh, to As up. for the... Laurel Birch bag that I bought. And I told you I spent $49 a day. Or I don't know. But that one big duffel tote bag, uh, they have sold for $49.95. So I'm going to list it that with the best offer and see. And then they cover the whole day of everything else. So I yeah. hope so. Um, but anyway, I guess I may do a sales video. I don't know. I'll see. I've been thinking about it, but uh, sales were so dead for so long, but now they really picked up. 
You're selling a lot of our old stuff, which, hey, bye. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm trying to think. Anything else? No, I'm trying to think of this thing. Oh. Don't be so busy making a living that you forget to make a life. He's still in there. Remember. Just... Don't be so busy? No, don't get so busy. Which the doc so he goes busy. everywhere with me and like when the nurses and doctors were asking questions, I told him that's what you was asking. I, I don't know. I literally do not know. He he does all my medications. He does uh, when I when we do stuff. I, I, I don't remember it. I just don't remember. It's like one more thing that it's taking up room in my head and I don't have room for weight. So he remembers and stuff and that counts. Yeah. I and guess. they look at me and I go, hmm. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, okay, so uh, I hope you're having really good weather. Everybody should be having good weather by now. Uh, I think there's supposed to be some storms coming over the weekend for a lot of people. So I hope yeah. if it does, you need them for your crops and plants and all that stuff. We're getting our storms today and maybe a little bit in the morning tomorrow. But then we're supposed to be... Weekends. Weekend, maybe. They said there's a the real, real warm... But only a 20% chance of rain. Yeah, I don't like the 80s. 70s I can deal with. 80s and above, I don't like. But anyway, mm -hmm. oh, we're wandering again. I have yeah. talent to do that. Mm -hmm. And if you know anything about these here. The, the dream thing, what you think that's made out of, uh, mm -hmm. let me know. Because I don't... We, The only ones we've ever dealt with were the cheap The real cheap, cheap ones. When we used ones. to have our, our store in Baton Rouge. And we sold the ones we got from China, you know, but yeah, and, and, you like know, the little teenager girls like to hang over the bed and stuff. We pay a quarter piece for them and sell them for five dollars a piece. Yeah, and, you know. But I don't know. I've never had anything like this, and I don't know. I thought for some strange reason I thought they had well, and they may have in the authentic real ones back in the old days had fur, and they can't do the fur now, so they're doing like you said cotton or something. But you like know, cotton. well, it could be wool now. I think about it. Could be uh. Uh, I thought that'd be animal. Yeah, that would be animal. Well, anyway, so if you know anything about that, then give me information. In the information, uh, let me know so I can get a starting point before I start lighting it up or whatever. And uh, hope you uh, like what you saw. And uh, subscribe. We've kind of been sitting at. I know that just somebody's coming to visit. We've been sitting at level, but we haven't been doing many. We have videos. videos so we're gonna start doing more. Yeah, acupuncture is really helping. Uh, I'm doing a lot better. Getting around a lot better now. Mm -hmm. And I asked the doctor today, and he said, uh, "Yeah, he he believes, and he said if it keeps you off of narcotics, then yeah. you know." And he said, "You obviously are getting some relief." Uh, he said, "You know, more power to you." So, yeah, uh, and it is. Uh, I do not want any drugs. Well, I want some. I'm some, not. I don't want any pain drugs. Yeah. Anyway, okay. We done? Yeah. Do we have to say it again? Or no, we no, run out for another 10 minutes? No. Oh, okay. Just rewind we'll just if you want to hear it again. Yeah, we said it 10 minutes ago. Be nice, be kind, and treat, treat everybody. Good, good. luck. Drifting and garaging this weekend. Yes. I hope y'all find some good stuff. Okay. Okay. Bye. Bye. Oh, come on.